everyone welcome to another uh, repair video so today we are going to try to upgrade an old school Lenovo GV laptop um, it's quite old it's a 2014 model but I think it's still relevant like for office works and other things because it's an i7 or i5 I think but so let's just try to revive the old laptop and see if it's still relevant today so without further ado let's do this upgrade or repair this old Lenovo G4 I think this is um, year 2014-2015 old school laptop there you go G4 um, it's quite old but trusty look at the um, keyboards and the bezels are still thick I think this is uh, 720p um, but this is good before and yeah let's take a look how long it will boot so whenever I press the button that's the time that I press the timer too so let's start and let me play music for you So old school laptops uh, use HDD that makes it s slower and I think this uh, particular model is 4 gig of RAM there you go 40 second mark You know, if you use this kind of laptop today, everyone will get mad at you so slow. Okay, I'll just hit stop on the timer whenever I see the Windows um, desktop. all right one minute and 30 seconds okay to bring this uh, laptop to life and relevant to 2021 we are going to use 240 gig of ssd and 4 gigs of ram uh, i think this is kingston and a sand disk ssd so yeah let's uh, do it this is ssd solid state up to 530 uh, mbps file transfer so let's get into it so so let's remove the battery <laughs> this is old school battery removal and yeah we'll just unscrew some screws over there i think there are eight or more screws so yep and bring that cover up and here we can see there's the HHD and the memory so we'll just pop it out here's the heatsink and the Wi-Fi connection still all good still all clean and yeah so let's let's pop out the memory there's like a uh, pop out lock on the side just pop it out and get it and we'll replace it with uh, the four gigabytes uh, memory mm -hmm. there you go just pop it right back very easy so don't be scared just uh, hear the clicking sound and you are all good 
and now we'll remove the screws from the HDD remove the bracket and um, stick the bracket to the new SSD card and just pop it right back so easy so while you watch this don't forget to share like and subscribe I have a bunch of uh, tech um, videos and also cooking videos and whatever is and uh, I mean everything under the sun so here H here SSD sealed and all good to go just place the bracket on the side and then just pop it right back very easy just wipe it clean Okay, so when you put it and then slide it back to the right and you will see the screws align that's how you know that it's in and put back the screw put back the screws and clean the cover and pop it right back push it up and there you go very easy now Okay, I went ahead and installed a fresh uh, new copy of um, Windows 11 and it works well. So here is so here is a comparison of performance of uh, before and after that. Right? So yep, don't forget to click share, like and subscribe um, to help this channel to see more upgrade and repair videos. So yeah, help me out guys. Subscribe now. Let's check the performance difference from the first time and after the upgrade so same process i hit the start button of the timer and i will stop it whenever i see the windows desktop and yeah a lot difference 15 second mark there's already the uh, the opening window and oh yeah 24 second mark Peace out. Subscribe now.